Okay guys, we're here with the Airbus A330. I just want to show you, this isn't an unboxing, this is an uncarring. Which is probably worse. It's a lot worse when you got a big humongous plane that you actually don't want to damage at all. It's very nerve wracking. Okay, so that's the way, ultimately at some point, I want it to come out this way. But I gotta get some magnets and stuff. Andrew, watch your head. I have to be able to do this on my own. Just hold still, please. Okay. That was not good, guys. Okay, those wires, magnets, you see it all? Get a shot of it, please, mm -hmm. so that the people at home can see. This is one of the things you don't typically see when you watch a YouTube video because it's ridiculous. I've got a thing stuffed in there to keep the battery where it belongs. You guys haven't seen my wing inspection lights yet. This is basically how it works right now. There's going to be some modifications to make it easier to load into the car. She's assembled. Wing inspection lights, got to repaint another coat on there. Batteries in there, CG's as close as it's ever going to get for the moment. Turn a G60 through 120C, 3300 4S. You heard it right, 4S guys. That's what the manufacturer specifies. Now I just got to see if I can get this wiring. See this, how I made this come out? Guys, that's going to come out so I can get the wires through. See that? Stabilization is going like a maniac. It's all part of the show. Seriously, all part of the show, guys. So we're going to tuck that down. We're going to see if we can get that in there without forcing it. Because I don't want to break all this crap just to get it in one time in a hurry for a video. Okay, now when I put this lid on, it's going to push it down the last little bit of the way. I hope. And if not, we'll re-situate it. Okay. It's in there. Stabilization. Up is up. Up is up. Up is up. Okay, we're good. That appears to be backward, does it not? Okay. Woo! Scary, guys. Real scared here. Real scared. Cycling the landing gear one second here so that the main gear door close. I do not like this buckled up like this. This is not the way it's supposed to be. And it's probably not gonna be that way in the future, but for today it might be until I figure out exactly where I can put the battery. Okay. Taxiing, throttle cuts off, stabilization is clearly on, <laughs> tested, ailerons, ailerons, elevator, rudder, nose wheel. <laughs> Guys, I'm not trying to go quick or anything at all. I'm actually just trying to move it around to see if the nose wants to break off with the magnets. Full flaps here just for extra fun. That's a full flap down configuration there. See the wing inspection lights? You didn't see that on the last taxi video. Also got logo lights on the back. Those big bumps, you think that's where the nose would want to come off. I got two minutes 30. You think I should fly it, Megan? I don't know. I think I should. Can you just do a quick, like... Not really.
Pulling up on it, I, I did a bunch of up elevator adjustments. See, I'm going on my takeoff flaps here, seeing if I can get it. Gosh, that thing was so sweet. Did that on purpose, guys. That's stabilization, guys. Cutting it back a little bit. I am shaking, guys. I need to calm down and fly this thing. Don't worry, this is gonna be an awesome high speed pass here. Okay, hon, I'm gonna try to land. Okay. Gear it down. Call it if you see it, please. Do not make me talk to anybody right at the moment, or I might have a heart attack. Full flaps are deployed. is underpowered too like it was heavy or something but guys i i gotta say it flew but my elevator was what the problem was it flew oh, slower it's okay. are you guys you filming still yeah do you want me to keep going okay yeah keep going guys one thing i noticed my nose did not come off everybody just so you know the yeah. nose is still attached yay <laughs> throttle cuts on i'm getting rid of this so i don't bump into the controls the throttle cut is engaged I hope that didn't lift from a puff pack, which it didn't. Guys, couple things. Battery needs to move back. I need a little bit more center of gravity back. Secondly, let's check the ESC cavity and make sure anything isn't on fire. ESC cavity. A little bit of glue. A little bit of glue, guys. No big deal. I can live with that. They're warm. That's to be expected. Guys, that plane looks awesome couple things I need to watch out for not a big deal I can definitely manage I need to put my elevator to 150% throws I need to put this thing on a weight loss program let's check the wing tips did the wings get scraped um check the other way oh, this is the one right looks good yeah looks good I guys it, did, any it damage. Didn't, didn't damage at all okay oh no it's on the bottom of the cell it hit the cell son of a biscuit all right we got it on film, everybody. It flew one time. But I tell you what, you get the CG back, this thing's gonna fly a lot better. It's gonna fly under less power. Um, if I tried that on 3S, it would have been into the curve, which by the way, did you guys like how I planned out to take off like inches above the curve? Sure, how yeah. I wrote that down for like a week mm -hmm. ahead and planned it out. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna take off from way back there and I'm gonna run up and next time I'll probably be taking off halfway through. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.